Jackson was not only the capital of Mississippi, but also a major manufacturing center, supplying the South with much needed materials of war. Two corps from the Union Army under General Sherman and McPherson marched against Jackson, intending to cut off the city and its railroads from Vicksburg. Southern General Joseph Johnston was ordered by the Secretary of War to proceed at once to Mississippi and take command of all forces in the field. The Mississippi capital must not fall into enemy hands. Before an all-out attack commenced, the Union made an unexpected move. A small group of elite soldiers were dispatched to weaken the defenses of the city and create a diversion for the coming onslaught. Edward Hogger, is it? I've heard good things about you. You're a member of Captain Blazer's Scouts. I need a man who's an excellent shot and can infiltrate enemy territory. Report to Sergeant McKinley. He'll tell you what to do. And son, don't disappoint. Every one of you boys was chosen by the old man for a critical mission. This city is our target. It's being used as a supply line for the whole area. Don't fool yourselves into thinking this will be easy. The place is swarming with Rebs, and it's heavily defended. That said, we're gonna go in, blow up our targets, and get out of there. I'm in 
trouble! 